Crushes. We all had them. Girls, boys, animals, robots, cartoons. <laughs> We're going to be telling our funniest crush stories. And at the end, you're going to know who everyone likes. I have a crush on you. Get away from me. I'm going to tell you guys a true crush story that happened in elementary school. And I still have the evidence to this day for some reason. What do you mean evidence? Bro has been holding on to this for the rest of his life. I've been, <laughs> <laughs> I've been keeping it a lock. Bro's still waiting for it to say yes, bro. <laughs> <laughs> so back in my peak elementary school, you know, the peak of all peak people, you know, the alpha male I was, okay, obviously I received a lot of attention from women and, you know, even some men and, you know, even some teachers. Teachers? teachers. What do you mean by that? I had this crush on this girl for a long time. We'll, we'll call her Emily. Hey, Emily a baddie. Yo. Oh, she's in elementary, elementary school. school. She's in elementary school. <laughs> That way is an elementary school still. She was in every single one of my classes for math, science, literature, you name it. Okay, we were in all our classes. We we never really talked to each other, but that was kind of normal in elementary school. You know, like the boys stick with the boys and the girls stick with the girls. You know? Goodies. And honestly, exactly. And you know, honestly, I didn't know anything about her. All I knew is that she was female and I liked it. Good enough. <laughs> I like this crazy. Dang, Sax, you've been looking fine recently. Oh, you know that. Yeah. <laughs> It must be my look maxing routine. <laughs> 100 reps of mewing. 100 reps of hunter eyes. 100 reps of looking in the mirror and being depressed. Uh, I don't think it's like that. I think it's the hot new merch you got on. Ah! Dang straight, man. We got hats. We got shirts. We got sweatshirts. All the things you would expect from Socks merch. What about socks? We even got stickers. Oh Put them on your PC. Put them on your phone. Oh my God. Put them on your dog. My dog. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, that's the cutest stuff I've ever Machine. What about, you know, socks? You you think I'm stupid uh, or something? You you think I'm... A, are you calling me an idiot? No. Are you trying to no. call me out? No, of course we got socks! <laughs> <laughs> and they're comfy too. Click the link in the description and get some merch today at Socks Desk Store. Yeah. All right, one day the strangest thing happened, okay? She actually came up to me. Wait, no, okay, this is where this starts. This is fake. This is where the story gets made up. Oh, oh, dude, wait till the evidence comes in, Muffin. Bro, it's gonna blow your what mind. What evidence could you have? It, it's gonna blow your mind. You're gonna be mind blown. He actually came up to me. Like, why did she approach me, okay? I stared blankly, like, into her eyes. I didn't even say anything. Like, what was there to say? And then she asked me for my number. Mm. what? Wait, you had, phone? Phone? you had a phone at elementary school? Well, that's what I'm saying. I, I stare blankly into her eyes, okay? My crush just asked me for my number, but you know what's crazier than that? I, I didn't Did have a phone. Uh, who had a phone in elementary school? And I'm pretty sure uh, they didn't even exist back then. Bro, how old are you? I'm like 10 or something, or nine, okay? How old are you now? Because you have to have phones back then. I, I didn't even get a flip phone till high school, okay? High school. Flip phone? A flip phone that <laughs> way. <laughs> How are you real? I forgot how <laughs> young that way was. I, I thought that was all in shows, bro. What? <laughs> <laughs> how young are people you? People actually went around. Dude. People actually went dude, around. It, it all makes sense that? that you are actually 14. It Why actually makes sense. Why do you think sense. it's in the show? It means it existed once. Ali, do not be talking. You need a cane, bro. I don't want to hear it. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, why is she catching a stray? Damn. Well, okay, dude. She asked me for my number, right? So I didn't I didn't have a phone. So I stared directly into her eyes with no reasoning and I just said no. Wow, the game you got is crazy. The Rizzler. The Rizzler. I get it. He's playing the long game. He's playing the he's playing the can't catch me game. I, I followed up quickly. I said, I don't have a phone. I, I thought that would be the end of it. You know, I thought she would just walk off, but no. She smiled and said, What about an email? Email <laughs> Listen, you guys might have been in elementary school, but you guys, y'all are old at heart. Holy crap. <laughs> email. Yeah. Email was the thing back then, okay? Email was a thing. There was nothing else. There was no there was no Facebook or well, MySpace. That didn't exist. Bro, there's something crazy called PictoChat, bro. Just DS link up. What is Picto? <laughs> 
so trash. <laughs> Yo, how old are you guys, bro? I do not want to be in here. But, and I did have an email. So I wrote it down and I gave it to her, okay? I just gave my crush my email, okay? And she just walked off and we never talked ever again, okay? For the rest oh. of the school day, I was still in shock. And to be honest, I didn't know what just happened. As soon as I got home, I checked my PC and she sent me an email. Oh, mm. what she said. Why won't you? And you know what's going to be really funny? It's time to show you my elementary school Riz because I have all the emails that oh, I sent oh, to the oh, day. Oh, no. <laughs> single one. First, she sent me an email on February 27, 2012. 2000! 2000. Oh 2012. She said, hey, Nick, what's up? Uh, wait, okay, wait, before you like keep going, how did you find it? How did you find <laughs> this? He started it! He started it! Why did you start it, bro? Have you been just looking back on this every single day? <laughs> every single day. I told you, this is the peak of my life. I mean, everything's been downhill after this. Bro's still waiting for, for her to say, yeah, bro. So, okay, she sent me a message so, you know, I got to show her my elementary school Riz, right? So, you know, I, I, I send her the classic, you know, I said this. I say, not much. Just sitting around waiting for my piano teacher to come. You? Oh. Yo, you smart. You showing her. Oh. Don't have the emojis on deck. <laughs> I cannot make this up. This is so... <laughs> all true. This is, I tell you, I, I got the best risk because you know what she sends right back? That's so weird. I just got back from piano. She plays piano too. I'm locked in. It's red in the stars. No way. She's lying. No way. Locked in is crazy. <laughs> Bro's been locked this is the, <laughs> since grade one. <laughs> I, I don't reply to this. I don't reply to this. Okay. okay. I don't you reply had a to lockdown. it. Lockdown. Okay. She follows up. She doubles down. She doubles down again. And she sends me a picture of her dog. Want to see my new puppy? His name is Sparky. Oh, cute puppy. And I don't really hate cats, by the way. I actually kind of like them, which I don't understand. So I might have said something in school because she's replying to my last message. So it doesn't really make sense. We got a picture of her dog. Things are happening. What'd you do? What'd you do next? I reply to. Two years later! Two years! <laughs> you can't do that! I have been very busy. I say, hey, sorry. I have not been responding in a while. I've been very busy. That is a very cool dog, by the way. Did you get a phone by then or something? Did you graduate? What she happened? She probably doesn't even have that email anymore. Does she reply? Please tell me. She replies right away on the same day! Oh, that's crazy. Damn! That's Two crazy. years later, she says, no worries how's life sent from an iphone so she's upgraded it's a whole new oh. it's a whole new century so she she says no worries how's life so this is my chance okay i haven't responded in two years redemption art i can redemption right and you know i actually follow back you know right right away i said this long story short i'm at tennis school bro that the w riz and honestly that you might think that like would turn her away no she replied right away wow really that's cool. Still an NC or like boarding school? She's engaged. She's engaged. What? Engaged? No, <laughs> are you sure these aren't AI generated comments? Baby God, I will this show you. Fake. I will pull up the email after this and I will show you. It's all real. Can I email her? That would be kind of weird. <laughs> <laughs> that would be so funny. Don't freaking ask that. But you know, th this is like the most conversation I ever had with like a female. So th that was too much. I had to close it, right? I had had to say, you know, still here in NC, but I gotta go to sleep now. I'm waking up five o'clock for practice. And she said, Oh my god, have fun! It's 8 p.m. Why yeah, I had to go to bed. bed. <laughs> I had to go to bed. Yo, old man bedtime. That was our whole conversation. Was that it? That's it? Nice. <laughs> That's all. But it gets better. It turns out there is other email threads that we had. So this was just one email thread. There was another one. This one's actually, this has even better riz than the first one. She said, Hey Nick, I saw you riding your bike. Oh my god, just looking for you. Hello. She noticed yeah. you. Okay. Why don't you approach each other? <laughs> it's so weird. Just you know what? Well, we other. never talk to each other in person. And you know, uh, maybe I, I, I should have asked, you know, want to go to like a park or something, do some activity. You know, you know what I did? LOL.
bro, you suck at this. How did, how is she still texting you? Like, were you, like, were you a cool kid at school or something? I told you, I was the like, peak of the peak. Wait, oh, wait, wait, wait. I'm just realizing you texted her 13 days later. Oh, yeah. That's <laughs> how much I care. Oh, Yo, no, God. that's the Riz. Girls like it when you seem uninterested. Sucks, bro. You were making, like, Minecraft faction videos on tutorials. No, oh, this was before that. I wasn't even, dude, I was nine. Are you sure that this was your first crush? This doesn't seem like you had a crush on her at all. <laughs> dude, honestly, I don't even think, like, you could have a crush that young, to be honest. I don't I don't know. I think female was just like, whoa, females, you know? But yeah, that was my insane elementary school race. And honestly, I'm pretty proud of myself, you know? And uh, This is not even a crush story, then. If, if you're proud of my race, you should subscribe. You'll never guess who my first crush was. I actually know the date. January 22nd at 2 p.m. Damn! You know the time? 2024. I just found out about her maybe today. I don't know, but okay, I'm going to give you a little hint. I'm going to try to, maybe you guys can figure it out. She has brown hair. Wait, so wait, wait, what, what was the date again? January 22nd, 2024 at 2 p.m. <laughs> Wait, earlier today at 2 p.m. <laughs> okay, let's just, let's just ignore. Okay, guys, don't research. Don't go look into it, okay? Was it skibbity toilet? No, no, Ali. No, please, give me. <laughs> Beautiful blue eyes. Her name starts with an N. <laughs> United States representative. Oh, oh my. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Who is this? Nancy Pelosi. Oh, who the, isn't she like 100 years old? It, just, let me send an image. Yes, okay, I cool, need cool, images. Chat. I need, I, I don't know who this is. It's just such a low quality <laughs> image. Yeah, I got you. I got you guys. I got you guys. Look, Muffin, she doesn't have blue eyes. Oh my God. Her skin is like ripe. It's ready to peel off. Don't judge a book by its cover. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I'm just going to say this, bro. I looked up Nancy Pelosi and this popped up. I'm just putting that out there. Like, like, I don't, I don't know. Just the way she talks. I just can't. I just makes my heart. How does she talk? She's like, she's like, hey, kids, hey, hey. And like the way she talks, it makes my heart just flutter. Hey, you might be into my grandma, bro. Should I put you on? Okay. <laughs> is she conservative? I don't really know what she is. Okay, I'm just, I just love the way she is. I got DMs. You got DMs from her? Nancy Pelosi was DMing a minor. <laughs> Don't, okay, let me send my images. Let me send the first DM. <laughs> oh my gosh. Hey, baby. Hey, baby. Wait, he, said that a, he said that an hour ago. Dude, that was not an hour ago. He's an hour behind, G Base. That was like a couple minutes. <laughs> no, no, no. She sent that to you? <laughs> yeah, that was definitely her DM. I didn't say, hey, baby. It's her. Don't read the bottom text of that image, by the way. Don't read she it. She must have saw uh, Saxophone buys you Amazon yeah. packages. So that, that's all we have uh, chatted so far. But this is where the story goes down a wrong hole. Ever heard of um, Paul Pelosi? Who are these political figures, Muffin? Apparently, she is married. Eliminate the competition. This little stinker. <laughs> Talk her. Listen, Muffin, just because it's a goalkeeper doesn't mean you can't score. You know what I'm saying? You can be the mistress. What? You can be the mistress. <laughs> okay, let me show you the real reason why she's just so great. Let me just send it. <laughs> Not like that one. But oh my I'm, God. I might be in love with her. Is that like a billion dollars? Dude, I, I'm, I'm, I'm going to rate that. Uh, one Nancy Pelosi head. Th that's a pretty good rating. Out of, out of 10. <laughs> what, what about you, TBH? You got one? Uh, I, you know, I have a few. A few? This brings me back to elementary school. One, okay. Uh, wait. How old are you in like first grade? Like what? Three? No. What? Your first crush mm -hmm. was when you were three years old in first grade. I don't know if the age matches the, up. First grade is like, like seven. That, okay? I think. Seven years old, first grade. Okay. For the sake of the story, I don't remember the girl's name because she was not that important anymore. Damn. I'm gonna call her Shawty. You gotta say it with the whole act. Shawty. Okay. Shawty. Exactly. Exactly. Shawty. Exactly. Me and this girl basically talked every day. She was like my first best Damn, friend. Bro, she, okay, wants you. she wants you. She wants you. Yeah. See, I didn't know anything about feelings or anything like that. I just knew that, like, you know, I talked to this person and I'm, like, confident of her existence and that's it. I don't have her number, don't know where she lives, don't really care about her outside of school, but she was my best friend at the time. Okay. Aww. Then, right, this is where all went down. <laughs> she worked for the government and she was tracking your location to send you back where you came from. <laughs> she was your <laughs> Anyway. <laughs> She was your sister. But that would have been a bonus. Why? Why are you guys so mean to me? So the story goes downhill when one day we're having lunch. Okay, I was a pretty fat kid. So I had my mom made me lunch and then I went got school lunch and then I got to the vending machine. Okay, so I was I was like a ball. Okay, I was a little, little roly poly ball, okay? And I had to sneeze really bad, right? So you know, like I don't like you know when air people sneeze, they uh, <laughs> right? like how like dads usually do. That's like all air people, okay? There's a problem. 
Okay. Mid sneeze, it was, it was like stuck. Oh no! So I, okay. I, so I do like a, I do like a little <laughs> cough sneeze, and this is the problem, right? So you know, up. That movie made me cry. Yeah, right. But you know, like all the balloons. I'm so sad now. <laughs> Shut up. This is okay. why you got ghosted. Now, imagine all of these balloons. Okay, were one big giant bubble that Ew. came out of my nose. I was basically Ew. levitating. Ew. Okay, oh, did she was... slurp it up like a snack? <laughs> no, she. It's, it's, listen, that's devious. That is. What? I don't. I. How do I even respond to that? I blow this giant bubble. I start floating. Okay, and I'm. I'm you blow up. <laughs> I am levitating in the spot, okay? And then the, the bubble pops and I fall back into my seat, right? And I'm embarrassed. I'm like, wait, 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 wait. That's like the sound like a seven-year-old me. Charlie looks at me and she she covers her mouth and she goes, and then she's dying of laughing in in front of me. Okay. And now I'm like embarrassed. Like, I don't wanna, I don't wanna ever look at you again. I hate you now. Okay. I, I despise you. Whoa. Right. But this is the problem. She laughed. So she liked me more now. Ooh. She's like fallen madly in love with me. She would not leave me alone. But now I'm like severely embarrassed for I don't even want to deal with this person ever again in my life. Now that's Riz. So for like the rest of our time in school, when we went to school for like another like five, six years, because we had like the same school zone, I just refused to talk to this girl. And every time I talked to her, I would just be an absolute meanie bobini pants, okay? And that's how the whistler was. So basically, you had a giant booger and then you cried and went. Yeah, but at least I talked to her like every day and not emailed. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> whoa. <laughs> whoa. Wait, I was being supportive of your story. I was I was patting you on your back. I raised that a Riz out of 10. That was pretty good. Who who here has a, 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 a better crush story? Hmm? When I was 13, Team, I had my first love. Justin Bieber? I was sitting in my room one night on my bed trying to find something to watch, and that's when I saw him. The man of my dreams. And you right there. That nobody could come between us or could ever come above. And he had me going crazy. I was starstruck. Uh, are you singing, baby? No. What are you talking about? Shut up! <laughs> <laughs> That's the most aggressive I've ever heard her. So I looked up what anime he was from, and it okay. was Black okay. Buzzler Sebastian Michaelis. Whoa! Wait, he's not real? No. He's a fictional character? Yeah, anyways, my heart was pounding. I would wake up daily just to watch him. A little too much detail. I don't like it. <laughs> I would think about him at school, on the playground, but I just want to see him on the weekend. You're reading like a oh, book? What? He had me dazing, because he was so amazing. Oh, what is this? Is Wait. this a poem? Why is, is this a poem? <laughs> Why is it rhyming? But then my heart was breaking because he's not real, so, yeah. Who has a crush story? He didn't even rate it. That's a bad one. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, want me to go? Wait, is this when you were younger? Okay. Yes, I'm, yes it was. Wait, so, okay. <laughs> like, like current TBH? time, TBH? Yeah, yeah, oh yeah sorry, God. God. How many times you guys made this joke? I want someone to watch all the videos and watch the trip. I hate you guys. See, listen, uh, the way I was when I was growing up, I was a little bit shy. You know, I just looked at the girls from a distance. I want to go up to them. Stalking them at the dead of night. Aren't you still like outside that? their window. Uh, I am. I don't, I, don't, I don't look at them at all. Because, like, bro, they're scary, bro. The girls are actually scary. Agreed. Yeah, I know. No, the minute you look at us, our mouth unhinges and teeth start coming out. And oh, yeah, I've seen that happen. I saw a girl. I was at a playground. I think this was like fourth grade. I saw a girl and I was like, dang, Chowdy. Wow. Not way saying that to fourth grade girls. Anyways, her name was Jessica. Jessica is walking around the playground at recess time with her friends, you know, chilling. And I'm over here on the swing and I'm like, damn, I got to impress this girl. You know, like I wasn't like athletic. I wasn't like that smart. And I was like, dang. Well, you know what's impressive? Me swinging on the swing. You know what else is impressive? Me jumping off the swing. Yeah, so I thought, you know what? It would be really cool if I go as high as I can and then jump off and stick the landing. She's walking around and I say, Hey, Jessica! What? Uh, <laughs> that voice? Dude, yeah, bro, because I'm swinging and I'm wasting all my energy trying to get to the max height and speed I can. So I'm like, Hey, Jessica! She's like, yeah. Right, she's walking with her friend still. <laughs> Are you sure that's not like a grown man? Listen, anyway, she's still walking with her friend and she's like right in front of me. I'm like, what this? Right, and then I, I, as soon as I reach my peak on the swing set, I launch my body forward. And you know what happens? You know, she's still walking. You hit it. Why it? What did you say it? Oh, you hit it. You did <laughs> it. You stuck the landing. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I, I hit something. You know, she's still walking and uh, I crash right into it. Oh, I fly oh, nice. right oh, into it. Oh, but you nice. made her fall for you. Oh, yeah, you guys, you guys think, you guys think it's like something soft full landing no i 
flew into her so hard, I knocked out my tooth. Okay, I want you to Damn. know how far I flew into her. You donated your tooth for her. That's so romantic. Yeah. Was your baby tooth or your adult tooth? His adult tooth and elementary. <laughs> when do you grow adult tooth? <laughs> Bro, I'm still my baby team. <laughs> Bro, still waiting. <laughs> Anyways, I look up at her. I'm like, oh my gosh, Jessica, are, are you okay? <laughs> <laughs> bro's mesmerized. <laughs> I look at her. Her nose is smushed in, bro. Her nose is smushed in. And it's it's kind of dripping. And I look. I, I feel the top of my head. Actually, I feel a little blood. I'm not gonna lie. I feel oh, a little blood. It's not no. mine though. So did she like look like Voldemort after? Yeah, bro. Her nose was smushed. In. You smashed her nose with your head? Yeah, I've been hitting stuff with my head. Walls, woman. What's next? Babies. So is she like alive? Uh, yeah. She's uh, alive. You have to think about it. Why'd you have to think about it? <laughs> but then you know. After a couple years, I'm on my computer. I load up this one game, and then I'm like, dang, this girl's kind of hot. And her name's Monica. Okay, buddy. All right. All right. <laughs> oh, that's enough. Okay. That's enough. Okay. Okay. Bro hit his head okay. a little too hard. All right. I rate that um, nose. Nose nose out of out of 10. Who's got a crush story? Oh, I got one. <laughs> you don't want that. <laughs> Hillary, Hillary Clinton. No. <laughs> you know what? I, I'll explain my crush stories, okay? Has anyone seen a cartoon called Dora the Explorer? Oh my god, you have a dude. Crush on when, Dora I, the Explorer? <laughs> when I was young, when, when, I, when I was a kid, I was like, I cannot wait to see Dora the Explorer. What? And I was really? like, I used, to, dude, I used to have a crush on Dora the Explorer. Was this recent? No, this is when I was like 12. Wait, she's, she's like six, bro. No, I like think this is when I was like a kid. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, <laughs> but like a 12 but. is a big... Bro, just, I met you four years later. Okay. <laughs> 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 you had a crush on Dora Explorer four years earlier. No, wait. No, maybe when I, when I was a 12. Maybe it was probably when I was like eight. What, what did you like about Dora? <laughs> I don't know. I, just, just, I, I don't even know. She was just she was just Dora. She was just exploring, you know? You wish you were Boots, huh? Wait, who's Boots? You, you had a crush on Dora the Explorer and you don't even know who Boots was? <laughs> <laughs> I can't remember. This was so long ago. But... Then I grew older, and you know what? I was like, fictional characters aren't for me. How dare you say that about fictional characters? Do say I give that toothpaste on toothbrush. I think there's only one person left. Do you guys actually want to hear my story? I think it's two, like, five levels ahead of you guys to comprehend. You know, I think it's. Uh... I want to hear your crush story. We want to hear it, Meme God. My story happened in third grade. Back when I was in the gifted and talented class, you know, back when my parents were proud of me, my dad would uh, tell all the kids. Kids in the neighborhood. My son is very good. Gonna be doctor one day. Okay. Why'd you destroy his dream? I, I only had one best friend. His name was Jonathan. I was sitting around with Jonathan one day, and I was like, you know, I was eating my, you know, my food, my roti, and then I saw someone on the lunch line. And what was his name? No, it was not a her, uh, him. No, it was uh, a. It was I saw a girl for the first time. <laughs> for the first. Time? What about your mom? This is your first time ever seeing a girl? Oh, first time I actually noticed a girl. Okay. She was standing in the lunch line. Okay. She had like she had like nice hair and, and for, for some reason her face was just like Mimi, did you go up to do the Sigma face? I was sitting I was sitting in in the ta in the cafeteria just like 30 feet away. She didn't know that I exist, okay? But for some reason, whenever God was doing her a favor, oh my god. <laughs> I'm like Natalie, I didn't crash into her, okay? I At just least I had a confrontation with her. I just stood there and just watched her every single day. That's yeah, that's weirder than me, bro. Listen, it starts off, okay. I was planning my riz. And then I went home and I was like, I can't pay attention in school. I don't even eat lunch. I just sit there. Wait, 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 wait. So you can't do anything? You're just completely idolizing this woman. Dude, no, I was just like starstruck, bro. Like I literally like I went to school and I forgot everything, bro. I went home and I was like to my dad, I can't pay attention in school. He he took it a little bit too serious. Like, what? You can't pay attention in school, you bloody <laughs> I spent 50 years coming here to America. You get the <laughs> He's so angry, he's cutting out. I'm actually scared. But Juicy, I'm putting you in front of me. Keep him away what from me. What am I supposed to do? I'm what scared. Oh God, he's back. My dad, my dad got so furious over that. He went to school, right? He's like, this, this is not my kid's fault that he can't pay attention in school. It's the teachers, it's the government. Okay, they're all like doing something to my kid. They're brainwashing them with their, their stupid uh, TikTok and stuff. He went to school, he's like, you bloody teachers, why aren't you teaching my kid? You want to need to be a doctor. You should be in 12th grade right now. 
You freaking keeping them back. All these stupid kids. The teacher is like, you know, for some reason, your kid just like isn't paying attention to school. He's like, no, bloody bye, it's your fault. It's your fault. Right? And he would just keep doing that. He did that the whole entire day, created a whole scene. All right? of this is because of women. So what you're saying is that we need to eliminate no. all women. Based. This got, this started to get a little bit too heated, right? Even like the principal, like my, my dad went to the principal and he's like, you know, there's something wrong happening. Like, why is my grade starting to go down automatically or something? This is racism. Then the principal and the teachers, they were like, we can't have this on our rep in school. Yeah. So they had a meeting one day. It was all because of you? Yeah, the meeting was about me because you can't focus are you talking about the meeting where the school's trying to meet with your dad saying you're eating too much lunch they gotta put down the cost <laughs> all the tax paying money is going into it <laughs> to keep you satiated bro <laughs> Okay, so they had this meeting. What they decided on was that, uh, put you on a diet. You know, maybe I don't deserve to be in the gifted and talented class. <sighs> when they came to my dad and they told him, like, hey, we're changing his class to something else, right? I actually saw that as good news. In my head, I was like, maybe I can get transferred into this other girl's class. Why are you whispering? Your dad's at home. <laughs> 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 Shut up! They put me in the class in the basement. The basement? Seriously? Yeah, there was this class in the basement. They put me in there. And this this school was so like segregated. It was based on like the higher up it goes, it's like the caste system. It's like the basement is the, the stupidest class. The fourth floor is the best class. Just because of a crush you had? Because of this girl. Wait, she wasn't in the basement. Yeah, she wasn't in the basement. That's what was my surprise because I was excited to go to class. You were surprised that she wasn't stupid <laughs> i didn't okay i didn't know this this was the thing i didn't know this class was stupid that's when i first went inside and i was like yo bro what it's in the basement <laughs> I went into the class and there's just like the kids are crawling on the walls. They're ripping what? up papers. They're running around. <laughs> the teacher is like taking a ruler and smacking it on the board. Like, pay attention, kids. I feel like everyone there, all the kids over there, like just. Well, oh, if only that girl, if only you didn't fall for that girl. All you this chaos right because you were madly in love. <laughs> I'm telling you, bro. Did you even ask her because out? Because this. Did woman. you email her? Dude, I don't even know her name to this. I never <laughs> saw her. <I'm, laughs> like, respectable. Very respectable. If you guys enjoyed then buy our merch at socks.store before it's all gone if you have a crush on meme god's mom subscribe me me